Hey guys, Jim Bounds with Co-op Motor Works, and um, for you guys that did not go to the Tallahassee rally, uh, we had a talk about what's next for the GMC. Thought I'd like to take a few minutes and talk to you about Tin Soldier here. Tin Soldier is a 73 first year, 23 foot coach. Uh, it was found in a junkyard in uh, in Denver, Colorado by a good friend of mine. And uh, we drove it down and uh, it has become one of our, our new subjects, our new ideas. You can see the paint is, uh, it's actually bed liner. Uh, rat rod, what do you want to call it, a refined rat rod? <laughs> The wheels and tires, its original rims, set up as uh, with pro spats. Roof has been stripped off, no air conditioner, no vents of any kind. You'd say, well, is it black bed liner? The thing's probably a convection oven. <laughs> well, it has a polished diamond plate uh, roof, so it will reflect off the heat there. New wipers, uh, unique grill. Took the bumpers and brought them in. Flare kit. Under the hood, totally stripped out. Moved everything inside. Radiators up front, no fan on the motor, electric fan. Of course, you got to have some air horns. <laughs> Let them know you're coming. This is a pretty unique machine. Um, it was built to see what cool things we could do, what different cool things we could do. So let's go inside. Let me show you some of the things on the inside. Now on the dash, uh, a little different than what yours is, wouldn't you say? It's all been taken out. has one of our uh, air conditioners uh, built in here. Gauges across the bottom. Uh, uh, digital uh, GPS driven speedometer. Steering columns out of Summit. has Fitec fuel injection over here. Pretty clean setup, pretty different, very open. Windshield has the new, um, it's called uh, Air 80, 40% uh, uh, heat reduction in our, on our fishbowl. I think that's important. Because everybody knows the front of you just dies if you're going in the sun. So they've got new technologies on films, that uh, ceramic films for the sides and this new clear uh, um, infrared rejection stuff. In the back of this thing, this coach is set up for a weekend, for a travel, 15,000 BTU wall air conditioner. It's being run by a Honda uh, water-cooled EV4010, 4,000 watt generator. Solid surface countertops, these are Avonite, it's bowling ball material. Of course you gotta have a big TV. Little Magic Chef fridge. Nice, clean, open floor plan that uh, is great for a day out, for a weekend out. The entire interior of this coach was taken out, and all of this is new. Folds out into a bed, a laminate floor, carpet in the front. We have our new carpet uh, uh, driver floor mat in there. But um, who knows, this could be where uh, GMCs could be taken in the future. Nothing wrong with it at all. Motor in this thing is a 350 Olds rocket motor with Fitec and headers. Uh, As 
first features on this thing. I had to write them down. There's so many. <laughs> it's it's kind of crazy. But I told you about the 350 uh, Rocket Olds engine with Fi FiTech. Uh, LED lights all over everything. The Honda generator. Uh, it's got a Puma compressor with a four gallon tank for the air ride system and the air uh, horns. Um, uh, six wheel air ride. This coach goes all the way to the ground, comes up front and rear. Um, aluminum radiator, um, not the expensive one. This is a summit radiator that we're trying out with a, with a set of fans. Uh, it has the new aluminum fuel tank, the single fuel tank that we've been uh, we've been working with. Uh, everything's completely rewired. I mean, it's unbelievable. Uh, closet converts to uh, small beds for his. He's got two little little boys, and they fit perfect in his uh, in the bunks in there. Um, full size rear bed, solid surface countertops. 32-inch uh, TV, DVD, just about got everything. And the look of it, very nice. I really like it. So this is this is the direction that GMCs are going. Um, it's a little unconventional compared to what's been done in the past, but that's okay too. Um, so open your mind. Think about what you want to do with one, and uh, it's all possible. Okay, see you later.